Today I'll be demoing the Bulbul Terang instrument I've made for Contact. I decided to include a narration for this video since the instrument's a bit more complicated than some of the previous ones I've posted to YouTube. So here I'm demonstrating the basic uh, instrument. So you can find some information about this instrument in the video linked at the top here. Normally it's monophonic, but I've made a polyphonic instrument for this contact version. I've also included key press and key release sounds. I'm turning up here so you, they're a bit more obvious. The key release is quite a bit louder by default. So you want to have these turned down a fair bit lower than the key press. So at this level they're still audible but a bit more subtle than when they're turned up for volume. If you watch the demonstration video of the instrument, the key press and release are naturally quite loud. So there's also drones which are accessed via the key switches here, so the C through C select a drone of different pitch, so from a low C an octave below the lowest note of the melody to a high C which is the same note that's the bottom C of the melody strings. And then that D key switch at the top is to turn the drone off. So there's also a bowed patch, which is more like a kind of evolving string texture. I've got the key press and release noises off by default on this patch, but you could also turn them on if you want to for a more kind of live instrument feeling, which I demonstrate a bit later. So there's no drones on this bowed patch, but I've extended the range of the instrument down an octave. So the lowest note you can play here is actually the equivalent of the lower drone on the previous patch, which means you have more kind of full control over what's happening down the low end rather than having the drone playing on every note. And the final patch is a kind of swarm pad made from tremolo samples. Again, I have the key press and release turned off by default on this. But you can turn them up if you want to. And you can use the drones again on this patch, which I find can provide a bit of rhythm to the swarm sounds if you need that. So there's a certain level of kind of pointillism or randomness in this instrument because the tremolo speed is varied by the pitch shifting of the notes. So you get a faster tremolo in the high notes and more sparse tremolo in the lower notes. And the mod wheel can be used to control the overall instrument volume on all three patches. 
So that's the volume setting in the top right corner here of the contact instrument. So that's the Bulbul Charang instrument for contact. I hope you'll find it useful. You can download it on my Coffee or Bandcamp pages and also probably soon on Pianobook.